niko kuma niko na senator wa county ya Kiambu umuske Karungo niko aletiro muswada se senate oyo ose oyo rigete kuirania emiaka ya bara ikobera bisi kuru miaka 5 ogoika ene ase atebiro buna ati tobwena ati komente miaka wuchi 5 ni bere eyo era graba na inchi baro se amona bara And this is my statement as a senator of Kiambu County, Karongo Athangwa. Having listened to the people of Kenya and the people of Kiambu County, ladies and gentlemen of the press and fellow citizens, thank you for gathering here today. I stand before you not only as a legislator, but as a committed advocate for the democratic values that underpin our great nation Kenya. Today, I wish to address a matter of profound importance that affects the very fabric of our democracy. The proposed amendment of the Constitution of Kenya regarding term limits for elected officials. As you are aware, the current proposal that is before the Senate seeks to extend the presidential and parliamentary terms from five years to seven years. I firmly believe that this change poses significant risks to our democratic principles. It is a proposal that every Kenyan would want to align with, a four-year term proposal, because Kenyans are tired. They for sure would want to do away with the current situation. Looking at the person who proposed this amendment, the seven-year term, looking at where he comes from, looking at how he voted in the impeachment of Rigadi Gashagwa, where he voted that Gashagwa should go home. This seven-year term proposal is a grand scheme for people to retain power. And it's not just the president. All those, and especially those who kicked out the deputy president. Because they knew, and they knew the people that they serve are against or were against such a move. So what they want is because they understand they cannot be voted for in 2027. They want to take this opportunity and sneak another half term in their five-year term. As I ask Kenyans, if you have ever told yourself that you are going to exercise Article 1 and Article 2 of the Constitution, that the sovereign power belongs to the people of Kenya, if you have ever thought that you would want to invoke that article, the time is now. The time is now. You can imagine the leaders who are proposing a seven-year term, they could not tolerate one of their own for the next two years. That is a DP. They could not tolerate it. They kicked him out before he finishes a, a, his, his term. Mm -hmm. Why do they think that you should tolerate them for seven years? Can you imagine the discontent that is there in this country that people can go on with it for the next seven years? So this is a time for each and every person to rise up and say no to this seven-year term and support my motion. We actually reduce from five to four.